Well, artist in the final stages of a passion project that has lasted nearly a decade. Now she's working to turn a classic picture into a sculpture. Our man Mike Randall went to Niagara County to check out the progress she's made and why this means so much to her. Surrounded by bones, body parts, anatomy books, and some serious expressions, it's a typical day in this artist's studio. It's the fun of it. It's like putting a puzzle together. Susan Geisler is in the home stretch of recreating this 1897 photo of the Lockport Lock Tenders as 14 life size sculptures. The hat will be like that. And then I have to raise it up. So that's a derby he's going to have. Susan has nine years invested in this meticulous and challenging project. It's a fun kind of challenging. That's why I love my job, because it's fun all day. She's finishing up the final six figures and knows them all by name. That is Frank Lavalley. Her job is especially challenging since she's tasked with recreating each person's likeness, size, and pose. But you can see their personalities. You can, you, they start to get this their personalities come through somehow. Once these figures are complete and cast in bronze, they will join the other eight statues already installed in Lockport. Susan says when she worked on figures like Fred Wagner here, she feels like she really got to know him. It's just, uh, it's, it's kind of like acting. You become the character. And there's a statue of a man named F.B. Clench who couldn't be in the photo because he was too busy taking it. In, in 1897, you had to sit very still for these photographs, and they're probably just saying, you know, would you take the picture already? Susan's work can be found all over western New York, including her sculpture of local war hero Charles de Glopper on Grand Island. The Lock Tenders tribute should be complete by late next year. I feel like my old friends, you know, coming to see them. This setting has become a special memorial to some hardy, hardworking individuals and an ideal location for your next selfie. Say cheese, Fred. Cheese. Mike Randall, 7 News, Lockport. That is some impressive artwork.